have an artist in the building. He is a Kenyan bongo flavor recording and performing artist. He's also a dancer and a businessman. And of course, he goes by the name. Mtel. Of course, I'm sharing squad. I'm happy. I'm All right. So in one, two, three, I'll let you know. So ladies and gentlemen, let's put our hands together for one. Mr. Mtalam! Woo! Ay, 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 ay. Ah, nice! Ah, now, now, now we are talking. Welcome to the show. Thank you so much. Liku vile inafai, meweza. Nashukuru. Mm-hmm. Nashukuru. Kuzo viyaktu wa lafu, isi tunezongea after show. Tutongea, nyume attend. Nyume attend. Nyume attend. Ndote stame. How are you doing? I'm good. Aha, so, do we call you Hazina or do we call you Mtalam? Any can do. <laughs> Any can do. Yote ni yangu. Yote ni zangu. Yote ni zangu. Ah, nice. Mm. Alafu, so maybe before we get started, mm. you know, intro, like ni mimi utaka tu watu waji introduce tena, just mm -hmm. uh, kama kuna kitu ni maata inze, you talk to your guys at mm home. -hmm. Yeah, this is Azina Mtalam. Um, a musician, a bongo artist from Kenya. I'm um, recording and a dancer. And also a businessman. Yeah. Yeah. A businessman, utinouza nini? Kladi. No wonder I look like you. Where is it? 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 You know. Baby, baby. All right. So let's talk music. How far along did we get started? Where? For how long have you been doing this? Did you always do it since you're in school, or is it just um something you developed passion for later in life? Um, uh, I started doing music when I was still in school. Mm -hmm. I was in primary school. Na palendo nili nili bundua kipaji na nika nika mo kuchimbia na kukikuza mm -hmm. mm. after 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 pale after nikiwa bado nikiwa bado primary right. kulikuwa na tashushi kidogo kidogo hivi kwa sababu sikuwa nimejua bado nataka kufanya genre gani yeah. you know like you just like you love music but yes. you don't know what you don't know where you, where, where you are at. Yes, exactly. so kidogo being raised in a in a in a, in a christian family i was nilikuwa nime kaubo kutosikiza mziki nyingine as in nilikuwa nimeambiwa bongo is the it's at least the clean song hapo ndo kina revani walikuwa wanaanza kina yeah. demo walikuwa wameestablish yeah. wasafi mm -hmm. so at least they were producing some good music and clean music mm -hmm. so to kwa familia ikaonekana ah hiyo ndo mziki mzuri angalau unaweza sikiza kijana anaweza sikiza mtoto mdogo anaweza sikiza pia so growing up kusikiza bongo kusikiza bongo nikaingia high school so hapo ndo i think i captured the art ya bongo mm -hmm. And Nika more like, why can't I just venture into it and just realize myself into it? Right. Nione, at least where Penyeneza niweka. Exactly. Yeah. Right, so does that mean when you started singing, your parents had a problem with that? So, Babu, first of all, just listening <coughs> to music was a problem. Yeah. Like, you know, I bongo. So, you know, you know, you know, you you know, you know, you know, How did they take it? Um, it wasn't really positive. Yeah. At first, I was positive. But you know, if, if you really want something, you just have to go hard on it, Kabisa. Lazima we skume, lazima you oneshe like the, the, the potential in you, oneshe the, the, tunasema nini? The courage in you, and you neza ifanya, and you neza deliver. Mm -hmm. So, pole pole evo tu na waka mwaku buy the idea, and yeah, and that's how it came. Right, so, mm -hmm. so far, what do you love most about being an artist? <laughs> what are you enjoying so far? You own it. Okay, you introduce and say, like, I'm not just an actor. Mm -hmm. I'm not just an entrepreneur. What do you love most about it? About Usani, I get to speak out my mind yeah. through music. Right. That's the most important thing. Without anyone having to judge you? No one. I right. just speak out as in Kenya kwa raw what I feel what I relate with is what I speak out in my music. Right. Mm. And what's the worst part about it? The worst part about <laughs> it. Wow. I really don't know. Mm, distribution. Oh, okay. Yeah, distribution most probably. Yeah. Mm. That's the most that's the most challenging thing. And it, marketing probably? Yeah, yeah. Distributing and marketing. Distributing and marketing. Yeah. yeah. Oh, all right. But we're glad that you actually have passion for it. You love what you're doing. That's mm. the most important part. And uh, <coughs> your song, your, your latest release, um, Maua, you released it featuring Ayana. Ayana and you saw that there's another version with Tess. No, it's just the same. Uh -huh. Ayana, Ayana mm -hmm. is a group of Makini and Tess. Yeah. Yeah. So 
they they formed i had they, they formed the group after the song was released mm -hmm. so wakaamua kujiunda na kujibrand pia nao wakaamua kutafuta muziki kivyao oh uh, that's it because i saw the one like two versions and i was like mm, now that's it's just, it's just so the, the, like the, the audio, audio yeah and, then and the video no, yeah no, that makes sense mm. and of course we see uh watalam watalam ep am i in it on talam ep when is that dropping watalam ep is coming this month this month this month did you guys hear that this month watalam ep is coming this month so <laughs> tune in and let's subscribe let's yeah all right, so how many tracks, who have you worked with, who have you featured on this song in terms of collaborations and stuff? Apparently, did you feature anyone? Yeah. It's just, uh, it's just my own project. Mm -hmm. Project yangu peke yangu, kwa sababu nataka pia Kenya ipate kunisikia, ipate kujua like vibe ya ukijana ni nini. Vibe ya hazina mtala ni nini. Right. Mkisikia watala, muna msikia, muna pata vibe gani kwa ke. Mm -hmm. Shani leo. Bas, do hivyo, hakuna, hakuna msani ambaye ni memshirikisha. Asina. Ah, nice. Mm. Uh, you know, you know, you know, a whole, a whole EP by yourself. Oh, you didn't tell us how many tracks? Five, ten? Four tracks. Four tracks. Four tracks. That's how, that's where you start. Like, mm -hmm. just four tracks to, so that we get to know you. Well, so sometimes you, you, as an artist, you know, you know, oh, you sound like Meja, you sound like Yeah, uh, yeah. Sure. So I think like when you work on a project like that by yourself, it also helps you to know your sound, yeah. what you sound like, so that people can vibe with you just uh that way and um kenyan music obviously it's not it's not easy <laughs> wow breaking into this market so what keeps you motivated knowing that in the 2000s i decided to a part of breakthrough kitu cha muhimu ni dua kimweka mungu mbele na unaeka imani yako mbele na unafanya kazi yako unajituma mungu atafungua milango mingine hiyo ndo naaminia siku ya mtu ufika so long as you're persistent and so long as umeka dua mbele siku yako inafika na inafunguka all right, mm. and you spoke about bongo music. So, are uh, like Ray Vani and uh, Diamond, those are some of the people that influenced you? Yeah, sure, you Kabisa. Mm. Actually, mm. when I was growing up, I used to listen to them sana sana. Mm -hmm. Actually, Ray Amonize was my favorite. Oh, nice. Yeah, so. And what changed? You, you still, we must say my was. Okay, is. I <laughs> still is. Yeah, is. Are you looking forward to maybe uh, doing something? Doing something, yeah. Type an opportunity present Most itself. probably. Ikikubali, ikikuja, ikija, tunakubali, hivo, tunafanya kazi. Uh-huh. Eh. Na Kenya, unajua wana sema, like, there's a saying about nani kwao asifiwi something like that but nani ambaye unamred sana in the when it comes to like uh, music the music industry in Kenya who who are you feeling who who do you vibe to mostly who do you listen to in Kenya in Kenya I listen to Masauti sana Masauti yeah, yeah Masauti is my favorite artist mm -hmm. yeah I thought you'd say Otile Brown um <laughs> Otile is a giant Otile is a Kenyan giant let me say that right yeah I just love his his music is just unique mm -hmm. yeah so but for me uh, I think I vibe with Nani sana Masauti sana sana all right, so we're looking forward to that. I know that Jualazima project is a jipa where na masauti and a jita weza. So you know, and what we can get like Kenyan industry, we only say bad things about the industry. Oh, siki kukoivi, kukoivi. Oh, what chesi ke iya fa ni ni. What do you love most about the Kenyan music industry? Um, there are so many upcoming artists ama wale wanyo na chipuka wata ni tumio jina ni tumio upcoming ways ay ni fresh ay ni fresh upcoming ay ni fresh akuna mtu ambaye na penda kuitu upcoming spendi upcoming kabisa so wale wanao chipuka kuna wasani wa zuri sana kuna wasani wa zuri sana ambao pia au ndo na wasikiza kwa sana wale wasani ambao wako chini kusipabu wasani wa kubwa sa hizi wanajaribu kudaivasa wanajaribu kufanya vitu vingine vipia vipia lakini wasani wa kenya wa chini ndo na wasikiza kwa sana Na tuseme kuna wasani wazuri Kenya, mm -hmm. kuna wasani wazuri Kenya chini. Mm. So that's what you love about Kenya? That's, that's uh, okay. Now that's different sounds, maybe, like, we have different genres. Uh-huh. Kama, ya, gengeton. Gengeton music pata kuingine. Gengeton ni yetu. That's our own. That's our own. Yeah. I love gengeton. Mm -hmm. I listen to, who is this guy? Brida. Oh, know Brida. Know and speaking of Brida, today is his birthday. Is it t today or yesterday? I think today. today. Should be t yeah, today. today. Today is Brida's birthday. Today. And uh, one on the street, I don't know if it's true, but they say he's turning 24 years today. Oh, yeah. Okay. So you want to wish him a happy birthday? Yeah. <laughs> Bazenga Daddy. Uh -huh. Happy birthday, Mku. Mm -hmm. To tomorrow wins. To Nokpenda. Shout out to you, Manzi. All right. Mm. All right. So you, we want you to perform for us, Maua. But before you do that, maybe you can shout out Ayana and give us the whole experience working with her. How was it? 
Ayana actually it's a group it's a group of two. Oh, Ayana and Tess. Yeah, there, there is no there is Makini and Tess who form oh, Ayana. Oh. Yeah. So oh, okay. no. they are amazing people. Mm -hmm. They are they are amazing people. They are you know you are the mind of creativity as you know they want to diverse wanataka kujua nini nyingine kitu tunaweza toa hapa tuifanye hivi tusifanye ya kawaida vile watu wamezoea right yeah so i that's more that's one thing i love about ayana mm -hmm. and you should also watch out on them they are yeah. good yeah you, anytime they drop new music now you know the link you yeah have, sure you have max number you have a producer's <laughs> number once you have his number ah apo uko sawa yeah all right so we're looking forward to more projects from you and of mm -hmm. course that album that is coming we're going to be looking forward to that mm -hmm. king hapa na me agree sababu ana anajeongo just kidding. Like you bro, you don't want to see me Like it gets really bad. So I just use it to absorb like bad. But thank you so much for coming. Uh, we'll give you a chance to let people know your social media mm -hmm. and of course where they can find your music. Mm -hmm. And if you have any shout outs you want to send out to the guys that uh, know that you're here mm -hmm. and then you perform for us. Mawa. Yeah. Um, you can find me on my social media Hazina Mtalam. Kote Instagram, Facebook, um, Twitter. Um, then I want to shout out to, I want to shout out Cheza. Cheza Africa Distribution. Mm -hmm. Chesa Africa distribution. Um, yeah, those guys are they're awesome. I yeah. love them. Yeah. Oh. Ningependa tu tu wapele recognition yao. Okay. Mm. Ah, nice. So this Chesa and of course your friends, your farm for Ayana. and Ayana. Ayana. That is Tess and Makini. Tess and Makini. Mm -hmm. Shout out to the <coughs> both of you. The song is fire. We love it. And it's playing right here on Bounce Nation for the first time. That is Maua Bye. Ayana and Watalam. I'm an Hazina. Hazina. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Hazina. Let's yeah. go.